So good afternoon folks. Actually no, it's still morning, it's only half ten. Um, another wee trip up the glens today. Thought I'd come up and see the snow. Um, usual forecast today, nice in the morning, rain in the afternoon and snow in the hills. So as you can see there's a bit of snow there. So we'll keep going up the glen and try and climb up a wee bit of block brandy today if we can. But uh, it depends on the weather. Right, always got to give yourself somewhere to aim for, folks. The next stop, this big rock at the top of all these stairs. That's the next uh, rest point. There you go, stairway to heaven. Climbing the stairway to heaven. One thing I don't like about climbing, um, it's not so bad today, but when you're climbing up these kind of paths and you're slow like me, um, and there's people right behind you and you feel like you've got to kind of hurry up uh, or stop and let them pass, but then they stop before you carry on and oh, it's just sometimes a, a mess. But <laughs> but today so far, touch wood, there's nobody on my trail, so I can just take my time uh, going up. So uh, I've had a five minute rest, taking some pictures and some video. So the next uh, stop will be at the top of this next little lot of steps. Then I think it flattens out a little bit before it goes up to the loch. Still a long way to go though, but uh, we're getting there folks. Right, there's a lot of cloud coming over folks, so hopefully I can get up there in time to get some pictures of the snow because uh, the cloud comes down quite quick. I might not get to see the, uh, the snowy top of the hills. So if you get around the next corner, I get to see some uh, Snow and sun. Whew. As you can see, it's like one of these uh, never ending paths. There's that cloud I was on about it's coming over. So I think it's going to spoil the view a bit, unfortunately. Look, there's people coming. Can you see them? What the hell? spoke to that couple there they're even uh, dressed more casual than me <laughs> like they went for a summer picnic but they've been right at the top of the uh, mountain and across the ridge and down they were saying they left early this morning so it was lovely up there but he said there was loads of grouse flying about he goes beware of the grouse I think that's what he said but um yeah so about another half hour folks we'll be there I think I'm gonna make it to the the loch I think I will perseverance and all that just got to push yourself, so another hill here, so let's get to the top of the next bit. Then hopefully it'll flatten out into the loch. So close. I think the last time I walked on this path was one of the first times I started uh, doing videos and vlogs. Um, I can't remember how long ago it was, but that's the last time I was here. Maybe seven years, maybe six years. Um, so I'll try and find a clip or even a photograph and put it on here just to compare how thin I was then, well I've never been thin, but I see how fat I am now and old. We'll compare the two. I think I did the same thing, I just kind of walked and kind of held my selfie stick and just talked. So you can see the snowy ridge folks, just getting to see it no more. Looking good, but the loch is just um, in there, the hidden loch of Loch Brandy. As you can see, it's not flattening out yet. Look, path goes uh, up and along and up. Folks, I think I'm wrong. I think the lock is actually way over there in that bit. I'm sure it is. So it's got further to go than I think. Oh no. Yeah, it's still a, a hike, folks. Okay. Come on, we can do this. Go first bit of snow. There's a frozen pond over there. Jack on in a minute because it's getting a wee bit cold. Yeah, look, snow. Get into the snowy bits now. Oh, right, another two steep bits for which of things. And then I think it's down to the loch. Fingers crossed. Right, 
in front of me is the final steep bit. Come on, Stu! Thing is, it's not even a hard climb, folks. I've been passed by a pinch now a minute ago, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's glorious, folks, it's absolutely glorious. So there's the final bit there. I've got to go up into the, uh, into the lock. Come on, everybody shout, come on Stu, you can do it. Right, it's the last set of stairs I think folks, so it looks a bit slippy. I have to try and get up this one out falling over. Right, folks, I'm here, and listen how quiet it is. There's no wind. There was a few geese flying, not geese, um, grouse flying about, but that's it. So I'm going to head down to a lock. It's a bit boggy, but uh, we'll go down to a lock and then uh, head back. Made it. hear me but we've made it. People actually come and swim here. Uh, it's ice cold but it does you, as I said before in my videos, it does you the powder good. But I'm not going to go in today. I don't have my speedos so it ain't going in. But yeah a lot of people would actually walk up here, swim, sunbathe and then go back down. That's more like a summer thing though but uh, yeah look at the cold. Absolutely beautiful. Oh let's see a bit of snow. Right, we'll spend a couple of minutes here. We've actually got a packed lunch, but I'll wait, I think, until I go back down um, and have it back at that Gala Bridge place. But yeah, so glad I made it, folks. So glad I made it. So here we go. At the top of Loch Randy, the lost hidden loch. So as you can see, folks, the clouds have disappeared from the glen down there. My car is way down in the car park, just way down the bottom there, I don't know if you can see that. And then I'd say halfway down now, that's the kind of where I've just come from. Let's do a wee spin. Right, so that's where I went folks, the red path up to Loch Brandy. I just kind of stopped there, but you can actually go down the whole Right, we made it back to the car, folks. Yes, it was nice and warm coming down, actually. Lovely and warm. Got a bit of sunburn, probably, but hey ho. But look who's made an appearance. Du -du -du. It's Baxter. Baxter Productions. He's sponsoring today's video. Right, that's it, folks. So I've stopped at the Gela Bridge, one of my favourite areas to stop. Oh, you can't see because of the light. Hang on. I'll flick this round. There you go, the Gela Bridge. I was here a few months ago. So I'm going to eat my sandwich, have a cup of coffee, and then head home. And then, and then probably the rain will come on. Usual. Thanks for watching, folks. Bye.